So we have a Windows 7 clean system here and we are going to be installing the WinCollect uh, standalone version. So this is not the manage, there will be another video for that, this is the standalone version of it. So we start by copying the two files that we downloaded from Fix Central. So here are the files. We're going to start installing the first one. So we're going to do take all the defaults here. Next, and here we instead of manage, we said that this is the standalone version of it. And we're going to create a log source. Let's copy this one in here. I'm going to uncheck the system files, and this is really depends on, on, on the preference and what type of information you actually want to get. In here we need to define now that we want to send the, the actual logs to, to Curator. So we are sending the logs to the Curator console, so we call this console, put the IP address of Curator, the standard port is uh, 514 over TCP. Here we take uh, all the defaults, click next, install, and we go. Now, in order to configure this uh, standalone agent, we need to run the configuration software. It's very simple, we're going to take all the defaults. And that's pretty much it. Now, after having done that, if we do start here, we see this icon here, Win Collect Configuration Console. We're going to go there next. So we expand destination, syslog tcp, console, which is the name we gave, and this is what we put uh, there before. So we span devices, Microsoft Windows Event Lock, the configuration that we added, and we're gonna make we're gonna be making some changes here, but le let's leave this open and do something else which is to configure the local security policy. Again, this is a clean system, so I have to do this. Most likely in your environment, you already have your security policies uh, configured. So I go to Control Panel, go to Administrative Tools, Local Security Policy, Advanced Audit Policy Configuration, actually. So expand it here from the left. Go to System Audit uh, Policy Local Group. On Account Login, Audit uh, Credential Validation. And we th basically we are telling the system to create logs for that. I'm going to enable some other you know entities to uh, generate some logs. So here on policy change going to enable this one. Let's track some 
log in and log off. So do the same for log on. Again, th this is going to vary based on on the level of verbosity that you want out of the logs. Object access, audit filtering, platforms connections, for some networking events, policy change. Detail tracking, audit process creation, that's very important when your process gets created. So here I am in the Curator 7 to 8 with patch 7 or higher, just to show that we don't have yet uh, basically any log sources uh, because we haven't. Yeah. It's a three com, but we don't have the Windows event uh, just yet. So let's start generating some logs into Curator. So I'm doing here uh, pinging uh, Google here 25 times, uh, and we should get uh, some logs in in Curator for that. Let's start by going into the admin and see if those uh, logs have been auto discovered. They should have been. Very nice. Now let's actually go into the log activity and now add a filter. Log size index equals window and look we have even win collect I actually select win collect event yeah we can see that we have some windows event let's actually go in the last five minutes yeah. and we should have from the 204 machine which is precisely the windows 7 machine that we are working with is one of the events in more detail. So we have install win collect standalone. We're going to continue with uh, other parts of this uh, set of videos.